Good morning, students. Welcome to Big Air Easy Class. Today, we will discuss about fifth class maths first lesson that is large numbers. Okay. From this, the first one, first question is: Write the greatest six-digit number as a numeral and write number name. So we need to write the greatest six-digit number as a number and its number name also. Okay. So let's find out the greatest six-digit number. So before that, we need to check what is the single-digit greatest number. That is the greatest number of single digit. So let's find out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So these are the single digit numbers. From these, the greatest number is. Nine, okay. The greatest number of single digit number is single digit is nine. Like this, the greatest number of double digit number is ninety nine. So the greatest number of double digit number is ninety nine. Because after ninety nine, this is we we have hundred. This is a three digit number. So the greatest number of two digit number is ninety nine. Like this. Number. 
from this six digit number means this is a big numbers this and this these two are big numbers and this these two are five digit numbers so these are small numbers from these small numbers we need to find out the small number again okay so let's find let's find out the two numbers here here ones tens hundreds thousands ten thousands we need to compare ten thousand numbers from ten thousand place first so ones tens hundreds thousands ten thousands here ten thousands the number is seven and here in ten thousand this is also the number seven so seven seven are equal so let's move to thousands place okay now compare thousands place ones tens hundreds thousands in total in thousands place we are having seven here okay and in this number ones tens hundreds thousands in thousands place we are having four here so when compare seven and four four is the small number seven is the big number so the smallest number is seventy four thousand seven hundred fifty three we need to write the seventy four thousand seven hundred fifty three first here seventy four thousand seven hundred fifty three so after that the five digit number which is smaller second smallest number seven seven thousand four hundred fifty three need to be right here because when we compare this this and this these two are six digit number and this is the five digit number so this is smaller than these two so we need to write the seventy seven thousand Four hundred fifty-three here. So the five-digit number two are completed. So we need to compare the six-digit numbers. That is four lakh sixty-seven thousand four hundred fifty-three and four lakh sixty-seven thousand three hundred sixty. So let's compare the lakhs place. Okay. Here ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, and lakhs. In lakhs, we are having four here, and also ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands lakhs. In lakhs, we are having again four here. So all four are equal. So let's move to ten thousands place. That is ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands. In ten thousands place, we are having six here, and also in ten thousands place, ones, tens, hundreds. Thousands, ten thousands. Here we are having six again. So these are six and six. Six six are equal. So let's move to thousands place. Here in thousands place we are having ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. Thousands place we are having seven here. So let's find out the thousands place here. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. In thousands place we are having again seven here. So we need to we need to move to hundreds place, okay? So in hundreds place we are having ones, tens, hundreds. In hundreds place we are having three here, and in hundreds place ones, tens, hundreds. We are having four here. So when we compare four and three, three is the small number, four is the big number. So we can write the four lakh sixty seven thousand three hundred sixty here. Four lakh sixty-seven thousand three hundred sixty, and then the remaining four lakh sixty-seven thousand four hundred fifty-three will be placed here. Four lakh sixty-seven thousand four hundred fifty-three will be placed here. So like this, we can compare all the numbers, and we can write the ascending order of numbers. Okay. So let's move to the third question. That is, arrange in descending order. So descending order means big to small. That is, we need to write the biggest number to smallest number. So we are given here four numbers. That is, ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousand, lakhs. So five lakhs, forty-seven thousand, three hundred forty-three. So here, ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, lakhs. That is six lakhs. Okay. Now here we are having. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, lakhs. That is five lakhs, ninety-nine thousand, nine hundred ninety-nine. And here 
ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, lakhs. That is, the number is nine lakhs seventy-four thousand two hundred ten. I'm repeating it. I'm repeating it again. So please observe ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, lakhs. So in lakhs place we are having nine. So this is nine lakhs seventy-four thousand two hundred ten. So let's write the number here. Nine lakhs. So after seven, we are having four here. Four is in which place? 
ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. So four is in thousands place. So four into thousand, four thousand. We need to write four into four thousand here. Okay. Now we will move to the hundreds place. That is ones, tens, hundreds. In hundreds place we are having two. So two into hundred, two hundred. Two into hundred, two hundred. Okay. Next, in one in tens place we are having one here. So ones, tens. That is one ten is equal to ten. So in one place we are having zero. We are having zero here. So we will write the zero in one place. Okay. Let's add these to form. This is the expanded form of nine lakh seventy four thousand two hundred ten. When we add all these, this will become nine lakh seventy four thousand two hundred ten. So, students, here we are having another number that is the smallest six digit number using these digits. These digits that is one lakh two thousand two hundred seventy nine. Now we need to expand these also. Okay. So. Let's observe ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, lakhs. Okay. So in last place we are having one. So that is one lakh. That is one lakh. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousands, lakhs. Okay. Now we will move to third ten thousands place. That is in ten thousands place we are having zero. So from zero we don't need to write the zero here. So let's move to the thousands place. So in thousands place we are having two here. Ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. So two into thousand, two thousand. Okay. Now let's move to the hundreds place. In hundreds place ones, tens, hundreds we are having four. That is four into hundred, four hundred. Next, tens place. In tens place, ones and tens. In tens place, we are having seven here. That means seven into ten, seventy. Plus, here in ones place, we are having nine. So nine into one, nine one the 